Hi everyone, welcome back to another video of AS Code. In this tutorial, we will learn about the CSS Flex Box. The CSS Flex Box is flex item is a very important item for this any type of if you are making a website or if you are doing something by doing your SSS, HTML and SSS, CSS. So you must need that this Flex Box. This Flex Box is very most important if you want to make some item shrink here, this one line and row column basis and like this. So you must need this the Flex Box. So let's start this. So you can see here I have added this basic HTML and the basic CSS file. And here I am copying this body and paste here. And here I am typing this display flex. So that's why here's also I'm using the display flex. The flex method is can apply us that for this apply this for this all item we will make it in the center. This all item this first here this justify content align item and it will be forced to all our element is go to center. So here in this body section we are adding this flex box the class name here and copy it and paste here. So here we will type for this flex box item for the CSS. So here I'm going to type this display flex. But this is our main property, and we are going to type this. So here this the display flex, and here I'm typing this justify content center, and align item center. So we think uh, it's not it. Just we need the CSS flex, the display flex. It's mostly important. So we're writing this as like here, and now we'll add some card item. So here I'm adding this card one, card two, card three, and card four. So here we will type this card value here and this item we will copy this flex box class and here we will type this again this class and type here and now we will copy this card item so we can do some another thing that is that will be most important this is will be easy for you that is we are going to be for instead of card we are writing here this flex box so let's copy and paste it on the one and now we will go to this CSS open here and I will set this width that is here I am going to set this 200 pixel and height also the same as 200 pixel and here I'm typing a color that is background red for this instead of and now I will copy and paste this all item so now we'll change this value for this all of this item so let's change this here so here this all of item value is almost changes here okay now we'll change this the color value here this background color value red blue green and here I'm typing this yellow color so let's select it like a orange color as so that and now you can see just like this so now we will make this go to this up here and we will say that that is width is here I am going to set this this flex box width is 700 pixel and we can also set here a height that is here I am going to set this but we can no need to set that width height here it will be by default set here so let's open this all full screen and you can see like this so I think we have some mistake that color is not showing here and now we will add a margin for this all item that is here this margin 10 pixel will make here for this all of this card here also which we have chosen that now you can see this all we have so now we think have some mistake for here okay we got this here so we need to add this value here correctly so now you can see the different type of four colors here so now let's go to this our flex box item here and now we'll make this for this item this is our main property about this flex box so let's set this for here I'm going to make it a proper animation for that you can understand easily so here I'm typing this main property and I will make a minimize and now we'll change this value for this display flex here I'm going to make it block if we make it block so you can see here this type of a column shari here and you can see like this and if we make it the flex it will be go for a row sizing here so this is very important for you if you want to make your responsive in your website here like this so here I'm using this another properties flex direction is column it's also make this all item goes to column here and here we go to choose that the flex wrap you can also use this flex wrap property and you can make this all of your property which you want to make here just write the search here and this write is and enter here and you can see that all of properties working as a different type of flex box working here so now I'm here I'm going to this the our main flex box here so, and here we are going to add a flex basis that is 30 pixel and it will be for this 30 pixel 30 percent for this flex box and here we are going to make it here's just we are going to here this this item for this kit okay flex let's open it here and you can choose there this a lot of flex item you can see here this it's plain line flex it will be make this all item good rows and now we'll change this value here this so here i'm going to choose that this is mozo that it will be work for this year mozilla browser system here so like this now we'll go to this the main property is mostly we use this display flex item so it's low and you can see like this so thank you so much for watching video